Good afternoon, Year 6. My name's Mr Jackman. I'm one of the assistant heads at the forest. You probably won't see me teaching until you get to that building over there, the sixth form. But most of the time, you'll see me at every break, every lunch, here, outside your area for playing football. What you need to do first is you need to change into your trainers that you bring every day, ready to leave them there to go into the courts. I'll come like those people behind us at the moment, thank you PE department. You're waiting. Ready to enter the fray of the football courts. When we come in here, we're only allowed in here with trainers on. We're not allowed bags, no food, to keep it nice and clean. We've then got a specialist area for you to be able to play football. Nice big wide space. I spend most of my time making sure everybody's safe, but dodgy footballs at the same time. Fellas, if you'd like to go and show us the space for the year sixes. This area is used by the year nines and year tens. The area over there, the year sevens and the year eights. Really popular. You bring your own footballs, you've got your own trainers. 25 minutes playing football with all your mates, honing those skills, ready to represent the school at a later date. Normally when I'm standing here, some wayward balls will come my way, depending on how accurate they are. Oops, there's the first one. But it doesn't matter if it's all good fun, I can duck and weave with the best of them. What you're recognising now is the quality of the PE teacher you'll get. Good luck. Hope to see you in September. Let me just show you one or two things that we actually do. The Bunsen burn. Taking this glass pipe, and notice the glass pipe has a hole, it's hollow. And if I use my test tube holders here and it. and take my glass pipe, put it into the chimney, like that, Now I don't know if you can see that, but I just lit it at the other end. Now why is that happening? I'll let you find out when you come in year seven. Hello there, my name is Miss Khan and I'm an English teacher here at the Forest Boys and I'm really looking forward to meeting each and every single one of you. Now before you start with us, you're going to be reading a book called The Northern Lights which follows the journey of a character called Lyra. Now every single character in the book actually has a familiar, it's what they call a demon in the book. It grows and develops with them and actually ends up representing the kind of character they are. So the character that I would say best represents me is a swan. It's majestic, it's secretive and it also protects its own. So if you don't actually get a chance to read the book, which I really hope you do, please watch the series on BBC iPlayer. It's called His Dark Materials. It's only an eight episode long series and it's really enjoyable. So I really hope you have a lovely summer and I look forward to meeting you all in the future. Bye bye. Oh, hi guys. Didn't notice you there. As you can see, Mr. Massey here, just sitting in my garden, enjoying a bit of the sun before it inevitably starts raining. But me and the cats, whilst we're sitting here, we've got a bit of a maths problem that I'm struggling with. Maybe you can help me. So here it goes. There's four boys on the way to school. Okay, each boy has four backpacks. Okay, in each backpack, there are four small cats. And for every small cat, there are four large cats. Now my question is, how many legs are there all together? Hmm, let me know what you think. Come find me in September with the answer, and I'll have some kind of goodie ready for you. Good luck. Have a good summer, guys.